what is the essence of Christmas without food on your table due to high cost of living in the country? That is the question the natives of Okpokuma in Bayelso State are asking in the face of post-flood food crisis in the community. There's your tide. Of the George report. Every year, Opokuma, like other communities in Bayelso State, experiences flooding. In response to the perennial hazard, the natives resorted to panic harvesting of crops for survival. Their waters receded in early November, but one month after, a post-flood food crisis is a subject of concern in the community. The flood we just go don't affect every one of us. No food, no nothing. This festive period is just even by the grace of God also. We not get gari, we not get anything. I not get money to buy anything self for this Xmas. Me and my children I don't know how I go do. Our farms, the house, everything got rust, the roof, everything. So we did not have anything to celebrate the Christmas. And now there is nothing to show up. Even money, there is no money, no food for us to eat. The cost of living is high for a people with an economic lifestyle of subsistence farming. Something that we are buying four for hundred naira before. Because of the effect of the flood, we are buying planting one for two hundred naira. Imagine, it's very, very hard. A bucket of rice. We are buying two thousand naira for one bucket of rice. How can we cope? So we are begging. NGOs, the government to assist and enjoy <laughs> the, the, this, this festive period. Tomato aspect, no go area. We came to ice fish, no go area. Everything is high, rice is high. It is just by God's grace that every man is just sustaining. Traders in Yenagoa also contribute to the narrative. People are not buying because of COVID-19. Last year, uh, Christmas market is good than this year on. This year on is done. Nobody's buying anything. They are just walking up and down. You go there, shout, buy, buy. Nobody's buying anything. Global economy is shaking and Nigeria is also affected in a year already blighted by the effects of COVID-19. And with the high cost of living in the country comes the struggle for survival, especially amongst those in the lower rung of society, hoping to make sense of the Yuletide. Ofietime George, TVC News, Yenagoa.